change your boy if you're a man flexing now. I don't give a fuck about none of Whatever. A little more leverage. I'm lifting this. What happened, Jordan? What happened? Fucking intercooler pipe. Oh my god. Blown off. Alright, shit. Ooh. There's a blue, there's a blue one in Avon that's like ridiculous. Is that UZ? He knew we were squatting. Yeah. Oh, From the Z? Yeah, sure. Let's check it out. Mm, the black pearl. Where do you want to start? Start by how this is fucked up. Get that fixed up. Well, take it back to the shop. Tell me about the wheels. All right, these are Anki 512 wheels. Um, I had them. I got them off Jordan. They were on his Z, and uh, I took them to CT Wheel Repair, who really hooked us up. Um, they come out really pale in pictures for whatever reason. It looks good on the camera right now. That's Actually, good. yeah, it looks Does a little, it look pale. A little pale. A little bit. Yeah. So. Uh, yeah, we, we I took them there. Those are, uh, I think, Gorilla and Lug Nuts. And um, uh, I got some drill slotted loaders up front. They were in the back, but when I bought it, the uh, caliper, and this caliper here in the rear was seized, so it ruined that set and put in I didn't, uh, just the regular ones on there. So I'll probably get those chains out. I'm not a huge fan of the drilled and slotted. If it was just me, I'd just do slotted. Yeah. But I'll take it. It's fine. It stops real well. Uh, I got the, uh... Oh, you got lucky on this. You... Oh, yeah, you, you scraped on the... Oh, yeah. Uh, it's all set. The, um... It's, it's lowered on PBM coilovers by Max Pro Sports. And, uh, I picked those up off of the 350Z page that I'm on. Some guy was getting rid of them. They were brand new, still in the box. Um, had a couple guys locally help me install them. And, Don't buy a Veloster. Yep. Yeah, Veloster's over there. I don't even know that kid, he's weird. Or that guy? Yeah. I don't know. You know him? Stuck, I don't know. He stuck all his passengers in the back, and there's a wide open front seat. You're totally right. Yeah, I feel totally like. <laughs> what exhaust system you got? Uh, it's uh, an HKS True Dual exhaust. Um, I have Motordyne Art test pipes, and uh, I have the AEM intake. So. Gonna, there's gonna be some changes made. I mean, it looks looks all right now. I'm thinking about getting a, like a three inch intake because I've been yeah. hearing a lot of good things about getting a getting a three inch. And there's a guy I uh, I met whose friend makes uh, custom pieces out in like Ohio or something like that. No for, shit. For the HR motor, and he said that uh, they get they sh he showed me a dyno sheet where it picked up like 16 horsepower, which is ridiculous because I'm really. I really don't believe that intakes help your horsepower too much, but there's a lot of people that say they do. Even though I, really I just get better know. fuel mileage. Yeah, exactly. I, I don't. I don't really know what they do, but they do look cool. You do hear little whistles there and then. Yeah, mine. I, I had a. Up. I had a high flow exhaust, and then I got crappy fuel mileage with the stock one. When I put that on, I got like five more gallons. Yeah. Out of a fucking. So. Yeah, it just got a, it. Just got a detail. It's it's looking dirty already. Just because it's black. And that's just how black goes. Yep, I know the struggle. Flat black's brutal. Six speed or five? It's a six speed. I don't know. No, I don't know anything about these. Yeah, it's a six speed. It's a it's a six cylinder three point five. Um, uh, this is an 08 model, um, which is the HR. Uh, that it has forged internals, a better drivetrain, better transmission. Um, you get many more miles out of this. And Real carbon fiber. Yep. Oh no shit. Um, this is a GT carbon fiber wing. Um, I don't know the brand. I picked it up off Craigslist for a uh, for a deal. Uh, we got the the brackets powder coated the same same. Uh, I same like color it. Color coated the wheels. Um, I got the uh, I'll show them the tips. I love the love the tips. I'm doing out low. I love, love the look of them. I got the G37. They're either G35 or G37 flares. Um, they're like popping off here, so I have some JB welds inside. I don't know what I'm gonna fix that with, but 
<laughs> you know, just little things here and there. Uh, I have a new steering wheel actually. I haven't showed, I haven't showed uh, Jordan this yet either. Some Quick release? What's that? Quick release? Not yet. That'll, that'll be coming soon. It's blue, just ignore that. Sometimes when you get a deal, you don't pick. But this is either going to be carbon fiber with a green, with a green ring. So it's going to be like that. How much you pick it up for? Uh, I picked it up for one hundred twenty-five dollars and eighty-six cents. That's not bad. All that I had. That's all that I had in um, my PayPal account. And this, dude, <laughs> this dude was trying to get rid of this thing so bad, and he messaged me. He's like, "Dude, I'll take like two hundred fifty bucks for it." And I looked it up. It's like a, it's like a four hundred dollar steering wheel. Oh shit! Yeah. And I was like, I was like, look, man, it's not the color I want. It's uh, it's nothing that I want. But yeah, if you'll take one hundred twenty-five dollars for it, I will buy it. Dude, that thing's like all the way up. Going all the way up. She got a booty. Oh, she got a sexy booty. Oh wow. Your boy, if you're a man, flexing now. I don't give a fuck about none of you little boys. You foolish young niggas need to know I got a choice. I could beat your ass or just cut you cause I'm bored. My blade's so sharp I almost cut myself. These niggas need to know I don't need help. And all these rappers know not to dare step. To the wolf man for a reason Hollow squad hunting all season With the scout regiment intervening And bitch we don't die for a reason We put death on you industry heathens You see Thunder Man sitting on my left now And we came from the terror in another round Give a fuck about nothing now. You see truth in my floors, I don't need a ground. So we got Cummins over here rolling coal on everything. He's kind of ruining the meat. Hi, man. Get it, you did. <laughs> His training will blow up soon. This is what ruins car meat. How do you guys think the meat it turned out? Nah. It's alright. It's, it's small, but there, is, there are some quality builds in it. Yeah, they're really nice builds. Though. I mean, it, it gets us excited for, uh, for slam of the slam. Yeah, slam the real slam of the beat. Because if there's going to be this quality of, of builds there, only in that number of people that, yeah. that are saying they're going, yeah. it's going to be insane. It's going to be an insane show. It's I can't self, wait. It's like a selfie video. It's a selfie video. <laughs> <laughs> but this thing. This thing's fucking sick. Yeah, but that 350 though. Yeah, I don't know whose it is. It's pretty gay. Oh man. Let's see this one. Yeah. Shitty 350. Yep. Yeah. I raced it on the highway. I beat Piece it. Piece of garbage. <laughs> 
So, we didn't make an outro for the video. We came back. I thought Slam Dunk the Carnival was pretty sick. What do you think, Rob? Slam did the carny with all the carnies, bro? Fuck yeah. So, just to end the video, he's gonna bounce Rev Limiter. Guys.